All right. Let's see what old Charles and Jebediah get into tonight. And I'm gonna do a legendary bounty for sure. And then I wanna see if I got the Capitale to do one of them blood money thing. Start view details. Benefits updated. Uh-huh. I don't know what got updated here. Yo, what's up, man? It says benefits were updated. Okay. Well, there we go. We've seen the updated benefits, apparently. I need to pull up my, my tablet real quick. Hang on. I always got my tablet up, too. How you doing today, man? What's up, Glitch? Alright, uh, we gotta get to it. Got to get to it. Uh, I'm going to be doing some standing around here in a minute. So uh, hang on. Let's go to the bounty board. We're going to do our legendary bounty real quick. And then we'll uh, we'll be chilling. We'll do some uh, blood money and stuff. We're level 27 now. So these things I figured out. They're like three part every town every bounty board has one of these like multi-part bounties apparently it's over there on the uh oh yeah dude we're, we're gonna check it out here in a minute we're gonna check it out all right all right, all right all right all right let me let me do this and we're gonna um boy i just brain farted on what her name was what's her name etta doyle yeah we're gonna do this we're going to check out the new drip. It's my bounty hunter drip now. Because I'm a prestigious bounty hunter now. Brush. <laughs> What? Dude, there's probably a bunch of places I would never want to go, if I'm being completely honest. I too would be fine not going to Russia. Antarctica? I don't care about going there. Too cold. Ain't nothing down there. The South Pole? Like she only sent one. Okay, we gotta move fast here. Come on. Now the bait's already been set. Edda Doyle and her girls will be here. And Russia. Mr. Cornwall, you don't want to stay anywhere near these priests. I'm sure you can understand. I would definitely never want to go to North Korea. <laughs> like what? Sconce yourself in here. Now wait till they bust in. And then, when the moment's right, ambush Miss Doyle and escort. Bro, this is the drippiest Charles has ever looked. It still looks old because it's old Charles and he's got on his we're gonna get some nice clothes at some point, but he's still he's still we're still up and coming, you know. We ain't rich yet, you know. Once Charles has made it in the Wild West, then we'll get some we'll get some like real drips. But we still struggling. He's just a struggling old cowboy. Alright now, it's time. Find a place to hide and we'll wait for the guest of 
We'll look at the fit here when I get in hiding. Well, the lighting's doing something weird down here right now. Okay. You can't really see it great because I'm I mean I'm underground like in the in the underground parts. But yeah, Charles looking Charles looking uh looking good. So I messed this up the other night. Uh, I think it was off stream, but uh, I still was able to get it done. I did not start my timer. Hold on, let me start it right now. I want to see him stream uh, without me. I want to see him stream some Red Dead. Just see what he get, gets up to. Old Cletus. Toast to pop. So this is uh this is kind of a glitch here, kind of a bug. But uh I mean I, I guess it's kinda of exploit. I don't I don't know, dude. But the she just won't like they won't attack, like they all run away after a certain point right here. What's up? What you mean? We just waiting. We went on uh Edda Doyle to say something specific. Yes, sir. Nice. We got our rope out. We ready to go. We ready to pounce like a diagonal, like a, a puma or like a leopard or something, you know? YouTube do be doing YouTube things, man. We gotta check our streaks too to see what uh Disney ain't the same, man. For me, it was like uh, Lion King, uh, Rescuers Down Under, like The Great Mouse Detective. Uh, what was it? Was the Sword in the Stone one of them? The Sword in the Stone was fire, dog. I thought it was a Disney movie.
I'm trying to think. We'll look up a list here, and I'll tell you some of my favorites here in a sec. And just like that, we've done completed the legendary bounty, y'all. We need to, uh, I mean, they be, Disney be remaking stuff that don't need to be remade and like doing all sorts of wild stuff, you know? The lighting's not great back here, but the new drip is, uh, dripping, you know? We, uh, we kind of all black. We got a little green vest on. I'm finding a little sliver of sunlight to stand in or something. Yeah, right here. Look at old Charles. We got a bandana. We got that nice little hat. We got a jacket so we don't get cold. You know, his old man bones get cold sometimes. We'll uh, we'll take a better look in the sunlight. Got some nice pants, you know. Got some spurs on our boots. We had them going. Disney's dusty nowadays. Yeah, facts, dude. Uh, dude. Any anytime any any of those big companies get like an agenda, dude, it starts getting getting crazy. Classic. Disney movies, classics. The Rescuers was fire. Uh, we need to get by date. By date. You start looking at some of these movies and it's like Lady and the Tramp came out in the 70s. That's crazy. Classic films in order. Here we go. Alice in Wonderland. Peter Pan was fire, dude. Sword in the Stone was one. Robin Hood. I forgot about Robin Hood. Robin Hood was fire. Fantasia was pretty good. Wally. Cars 2. Peter Pan was not trash, bro. Dude, Peter Pan was fire, dude. And then anything anything in the 2000s, y'all just miss me on that because I ain't watching Disney after that, really. I say, dude, from like 2000 on, like, that ain't me. You know, that ain't my childhood. I don't watch any. I ain't watched any of this Encantanto and stuff. Frozen, no sure. No Tangled, none of that. No Brother Bear, whatever. What is Brother Bear? Peter Pan hater. What about you? Ever seen Hook with Robin Williams? That movie's fire, dude. <laughs> There's been some good Peter Pan movies, dog. Hook was fire, dude. Hook was absolutely fire. Cinderella was a good one. My girlfriend uh, loves those Disney movies and stuff. She made me watch Finding Nepo, ne Finding Nepo, Finding ne Nemo, Moon Knight. Uh, uh I didn't watch Moon Knight. Got like five more minutes here, guys. How about uh, y'all seen Labyrinth, the Dark Crystal? Oh, Nepo. Oh, finding Nepo. He was lost. We're going to have to step out in the sunlight and get a good look at the drip here in a minute, dude. Rapunzel, Toy Story 3, shut up dude, for real, I, I didn't even know there's a Toy Story 3, I watched uh, Toy Story 1, we watched, we, I grew up on that one, watched that a lot, you seen Toy Soldiers, where them little toys came to life dude, that was fire, DreamWorks is good, they make some good stuff, nah, you wanna talk about like, uh, Never ending story. Uh, the Princess Bride. 
Um, what was that? Labyrinth was good. The Dark Crystal, like that's that's some that's some stuff y'all don't probably don't even know about. Labyrinth is such a fire movie, dude. <laughs> Heck yeah, the Dungeon of Despair, dude. I like that little worm that's like, Hello! <laughs> oh, goodness. Or was Dungeon of Despair, uh... Was Dungeon of Despair Prince's Bride? That witch on the Princess Bride was uh was pretty creepy. I watched the Page Master not too long ago. That thing was fire. Movie's good. I'm trying to think of other ones that I got that are like from from my childhood, sort of like that. Gremlins. <laughs> Gremlins uh was not really I mean that's like the era, but I was not allowed to watch Gremlins growing up, but it's fire. I remember sneaking and watching stuff like that. So, if you don't know, there's a reason I'm standing here. is because Red Dead Online will give you more of a payout for standing and taking longer to turn in the mission. So I'll wait on this one. I'll wait 12 minutes to turn it in. And I forgot to start my timer. So we're probably going to be a little bit longer than 12 minutes. Kung Fu Panda movies. I don't know that I've seen all of the Kung Fu Panda movies. The Lion King. Not, oh, yeah. Yeah, I like the, the old school animated Lion King, dude. Yeah. Not, I ain't seen that realness, that CGI stuff. No, uh. I'm talking about that old, old, that hand-drawn, whatever it was. Lion King 3? There's a third Lion King? Or uh, Kung Fu Panda 3? <laughs> Which we talking about? There's probably a Lion King 3. That's one thing about uh, Disney is, like, if they're making money off of something, they ain't gonna stop. They ain't gonna keep milking it for, for all it's worth. The OG Lion King. Heck yeah. I remember getting so sad and getting scared every single time uh, Mufasa would die. And then Scar was always scary and the hyenas were scary too. That one scene where they were like with all the bones and stuff. Scary. Scared little child, man, duty is. Look, there's, there's old main old Charles and old Charles right there. Just like talking to myself. Oh dang, we just, we just got a, uh, we just got a good little chunk of change there. I'm trying to get where y'all can see the drip. Look at that. Here, this light over here looks pretty bright. You can't say the R word. But I I agree with what you're saying, but you just can't say it like that nowadays. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yeah, look at Charles, man. Look at him go. Look at him go. Oh, check out, check out, check out what I can do. Spin that gun. Look at that. Look at that right there. You see that, Jebediah? You want to learn how to do? That's right. There 
There it is right there, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. <laughs> yeah. His uh his brain's been addled by the sun and you got a touch of that um what's that? Uh like the some sort of swampy typhoon dish or something. You done caught from drinking uh drinking the water. Uh huh. Let's look over here. I wanna go check this out. We're max bonded with old uh, Jebediah now. I kind of want to wait on... I want a new saddle. Because that's going to be great when we get a new saddle. I think we get a stamina drain reduction in, or something. Uh, but I don't know if I want to buy the one that I can buy right now. Or like right this second. And right now, I mean, we're chilling, dude. Like we're chilling with the... Like we're fast. We're gonna go do that. Uh, we're gonna do one of them bounties and roads. Might be Capitale in it for you. And try and continue on with that. Capitale too, if you're lucky. Oh, this one's three out of three. Might even be some Capitale involved. I can't do these yet. We're gonna do this one. I'm trying to take advantage of these missions while. Uh... Nah, I turned off voice chat. I'm trying to take advantage of these missions while they're still uh like double right now. But here it is. Cause I think at the end of the month they're gonna change. Out of I don't know where to, but I know we better make sure it never gets there. Get down to the freight yard in San Denis. I recommend you go on tiptoes, but that's up to you. While you're there. Might as well help yourself to a boatload of supplies. Shame to leave it in the wrong hands. Uh huh. Capitale. <laughs> Turn on voice chat. Turn it back on. I might, man. I don't know. It's just beginning annoying. And I was thinking, um. Uh, like, I should have gone and talked to those weird dudes last night. Or, was that last night? Yeah, that was last night. Should have gone and uh, introduced them to Jebediah or something, you know? I think we're in a solo lobby right now, though, because we started this mission, so we'll see. I just walk up in here. I don't know what they were going on about. They, we had them one dudes, uh, they were speaking a different language. And then we had the one guy that was talking about something like religious sounding. And I was like, all right, yep, I've had enough of this. Oh my goodness, boy. I'm screwing up. I think I went in there. I might have, oh, nope. I might have, uh. Okay, I don't have like lives, I don't think. Dang, you made Charles lose his head. How do I get up in there? Dude, 
Dude, there are so many guys. Where are they coming in at? What is that? A boat? I gotta steal a canoe? I'm all for it. Where's it at? Is it under the dock? I'll drive this thing. Son of a bitch. Oh, don't shoot a hole in my boat now. Be helpful to have someone shooting. Old Charles ain't rich. We ain't rich yet. We're trying. We're trying to get uh, wealthy. Once I get over a grand or like two grand, maybe then I'll feel. Uh, I'll feel pretty rich. I, dude, I'm going to keep playing this game until I get tired of it, bro. Uh, I just enjoy it. I'm enjoying it a lot. This is the most fun I've had playing a video game in a, in a while. Uh, I'm hoping we play, play some more with Toast. Uh, I'm waiting for something else to catch my eye. I want to do it in Shrouded. I just hadn't got around to starting it because I started getting hooked back on this. So, and I, I do want to finish Unity just so I can be completed with that. And also, uh, I want to finish, I want to do Syndicate and all that. Just I, I got so much, I got too many games to play and not enough time to play them. You know what I'm saying? It's a problem. I wouldn't mind doing a story replay on, uh, just revisiting the story because I know uh, the story's great. Story's fun. Does this end the mission if I drop off the boat? Probably does, huh? We probably want to wait here for a sec. Dream in Skyrim? I don't know, man. Skyrim, I know there's a lot of mods and stuff, but I don't really want to get into like mod and stuff. Uh, just because I'm like I'm lazy when it comes to that. Um. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. Skyrim is looks. I mean, it looks kind of dated when I looked at it last. I was like, oof. I don't know if I could play that. I mean, I guess I could. I played Assassin's Creed One. Uh, I loved Skyrim back in the day. I really enjoyed Skyrim back in the day. You know, I think we're just going to turn this in and say screw waiting on the timer. There ain't no way this is the end of the mission, though. They gave me 30 minutes to do that, and then like 7, I'm done. Let's see how much money we got for that. Probably not a lot, because we turned it in real quick. And we died once. 0.16. 450 XP. 
$26. Not terrible. Not good, though. Yeah, 26 bucks because I didn't stand there and wait, dog. That's what, uh, I want to test something. I mean, I, I kind of want to test something, you yeah? know? I want, I mean, like, hold on. Yeah, they scamming all Charles for sure, dude. Uh, I need to go, I need to go a couple places. How much, what we got, what we got now? Yeah, see that, barely even worth it, man. Uh, I feel like the hunting wagon might make me some money. You know what I'm saying? We could do like the hunting wagon and then wait in between. But I think I gotta have the the profession unlocked to do to get the hunting wagon. And that was the third mission in that like mission chain. Uh. So, I do hate how that happened. How that happens. I wish they'd change it, man. I wish they'd. I know they're not updating the game. All right, glitch. Take it easy, bro. Trader rank 10. We're a ways away from that. We're a ways away from Bounty Hunter Rank 10, too. Any session due to network error? That's okay. I think we're still streaming. I need to go to the gunsmith. That ain't the door. Yeah, I'll be streaming tomorrow, dude. Uh, probably around the same time, though. You know, work nights. Be like that. Need to get this. This bow. Need to get this improved bow. Oh, this hurts. You can customize the bow. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. That's fancy. Bow string. Uh huh. Why do I need that's the bow string's fine the way it is. Leather. And that's okay too. Varnish. Can we get like a deep, like a rich mahogany on it? Ebony, like a dark walnut. That's nice. But we don't really need that. Need that. I think we're gonna leave it the way it is. You know. I wanted to see about these guys. You know, we sell plenty of parts to improve that weapon. I need that. That's what I need. But I need 1200 to be able to get that. That's all gold. Like, 
that's all gold to upgrade that. That's kind of trash to me. So we may, uh, I mean, that's kind of tight looking. Blue enamel, that's cute. That's new. Bruh, $479 for that though? That's wild. I think we're gonna save up money. We're gonna get, we're gonna get those pistols. We need like 1200 though. That's gonna be a minute. Uh, we we want I mean we want to do some of this cool stuff you know. All right, all right, let's get out of here. We got our bow though. We should have arrows already. We're gonna see if uh. What is that? There's a yellow dot on my map up here. Take out the muggers, you got it. What? Where are they at? He's over there? Boy, he's in a weird alleyway. Can't even get to him that way. Go around this way. Come on, Jebediah. Get up on here and get on get on back of jail. Where is he having me take him? Seems way out of my way. bodies man that's what I'm doing what you reckon I'm doing 
There's stuff they got that I need, you know? This stuff ain't free out here. What did I find? I just found something for 150 XP. Got a treasure map? No. -uh. When did I find a treasure map? Wait a minute. You know them raiders come in packs. Capitale. It's saying something about a uh, collectible that I found. But what did I find that's collectible? Can't be that. A collectible antique alcohol bottle. Watch me drink it. <laughs> I bet I can. Yeah, I sure can. Uh, all right. I need my repeater out here, and I need my bow over there. Yeah. And I wanna, I wanna hit something with the bow, you know. Would you give me like 37 cents or something stupid? Six dollars? This is a unique item. Okay. Let me use it. I can't use that? Why, how come? Take me to it. Let's see about it. Where's that? Oh, it's right over here. We're right here. That's awesome. I don't know when or where I got that treasure map, but that's dope. Probably from searching them fellows, you know? be somewhere out here in this battlefield. Found it. Yeah. See what we get here. What's up? Uh, returning, man. I haven't played Red Dead Redemption or Red Dead Online in a long, long time. So we just sort of taking baby steps. I mean, we're just chilling.
doing these bounty hunter stuffs. Because I want to do it, I want to grind it out, like really grind it out where I don't spend money on gold or whatever. And, uh, you know, bounty hunter gives you, gives you gold, uh, a little bit of gold here and there. Jib, you wait there. I gotta go do some reading. We gonna try this. I think that's one of the sort of the unique ones, the prestigious bounties. We gotta go find old Ned. Ned Billingham, that's right. Been overseeing Maine Moonshine Production near the Lana Lana Hanchi River. Okay. We gotta go find him. What is all this? This is all gators. Throwing his moonshine and equipment. Okay. What? Where's my dang? My rifle somehow ended up on my horse.
I feel like they'll quit coming eventually. I get my arrow back from looting them. Yeah, I did. Dang sure did. Got dynamite. I think I can shoot these barrels if I remember right. And the stills up in here. Found me some cognac. I got a little nice porch up in here. So I got another tarot card. Now last time I had the tarot cards, man, I had them in my inventory and they ended up, uh... They ended up disappearing or something, like, weird. Or I sold them? Can you sell them to just random people? Or I sold them to the fence or something? Oh, he drunk. He done turned up. He's getting high off his own supply is what it looked like. Oh, come on now. I think that means my timer restarts every single time that happens. Oh, no, that. I can't believe that that just happened. I mean, I can believe it. Jeb, get over here, bud. I know there's alligators. That's why you got to get out the water. Holy shit, you piece of shit. I want to loot. Sand and knee. Oh, that's a little ride. Hold on, we gotta get there. We were taking our time on the mission and then we died and then uh, got respawned or whatever. Yo, what's up? Welcome, welcome.
Look at them pigs squealing running across the bridge. Missed my turn. Alright, now if I'm not mistaken, you piece of shit. <laughs> we should shut up, fella. We should be able to uh just chill right here. And nobody come and mess with us. And he can't run away if I'm holding that. I'm gonna give it a minute more and wait for the three minute mark, and then I'm gonna go turn that in. What's up, Yeeter? Welcome, welcome. Just, you know, waiting on the timer to be worth turning in. I think I screwed this one up, though, because I died, and I think that resets the timer. I'm not entirely certain, though. I always wait till about three minutes and then turn it in. I don't know if I'm doing that right or wrong or what have you. I know some people say wait till the last 30 seconds, but I'm an impatient person. Turning in this bounty. The runner's eyes, so the bounty's yours. Right there for you. Let's see what we make. Point two four, thirty three bucks. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. Ain't bad at all. Yeah, we ain't in a huge hurry to get rich. I mean, we're enjoying the ride. I never really, uh, I, when I played Red Dead back in the day, I never really did the bounty hunter stuff, like a whole lot. Uh, so now we're doing it, and I'm enjoying it, and it's making us gold. Uh, so, yeah. Can I sell these tarot cards to anyone but the collector lady? And I gotta have the collector roll, I think, right? Huh. I got Eagle Eye Plus now. Look at me go. We're dang all bounty hunters extraordinaire, I tell you. I don't have the role yet. Nuh uh. I'm grinding. I'm going from like, uh. I went from zero gold to. 30 so I upgraded my bounty hunter roll uh, I want to go finish my my roads uh, the prestigious bounties yeah I upgraded um, upgraded the to the prestigious bounty hunter or whatever so th those pay out those pay out a lot better uh, so I, this is the only role that I have right now and I think I realistically what I'll probably do next is the uh, the trader because I like just running around hunting animals and stuff too you know um, I think the collector is supposed to be real profitable though so I don't know but I just hate running around getting all the collectibles I know I did it back in the day and I think I'm, I might have maxed it out I'm not sure it just got real dark on my screen goodness like we rode through like a black hole or something. But uh I wanted to, I wanna to get to where I'm moonshining again. That sounds like fun. 
And I remember doing some of the Moonshiner stuff back in the day, and those little missions were real cool. So basically, I quit playing like when rolls came out. Like I played the rolls like hard and heavy, and then I just quit playing. And I had like, by the time rolls came out, I was already like burnt out on the game. So it was like I like extra got burnt out on the game because you couldn't level up with the rolls back in the day. Like we were all just playing showdown and uh, hunting animals and stuff. <laughs> like and you couldn't even turn them into crypts and stuff so uh i mean it's changed a lot there's a lot more uh content for me to um experience and level up this way this is way more fun leveling up doing the rolls and the blood money blood money wasn't a thing back then either uh so yeah a lot's changed it's like seeing an old friend you hadn't seen since high school and he done grew up and uh like i don't know <laughs> you know you know what i'm saying it's like still the same old friend but things have changed a little bit all right so okay i see x's on their face so there's gonna be two more no yeah two more tobias and dan maybe okay so well i can't choose that why can't i choose that because I've done it too soon. Too recent. There's got to be a cooldown on that then, huh? On the prestigious ones? Huh. We can go get old Wallace. Well, he did. He burned down a store. The fire spread to consume the store. Three homes and two outhouses. Okay. So, uh, this other guy is a smuggler of dangerous contraband, originally from Rhodes. A police officer. Shot a police officer while resisting arrest in St. Denis, now a fugitive at large. Okay. Alright, alright. So, the cooldown on that. I wonder what that is. What the time is on that. This guy shot a police officer. This guy set a store on fire. Dangerous contraband that can't that can't be allowed. Dangerous contraband can't be allowed. That arsonist, uh, he, he might he might <laughs> he might be free another day. But old Charles is gonna go get this other fella, and he has terrible sideburns. Old Charles on the job, I tell you. I'm probably going to do that. I've been grinding the Edda Doyle legendary bounty. Because it's really easy. I'll probably do that again when my timer's up. But I've been sort of just chilling around roads. I like this part of the map for one. And uh, for two, it's where I started those prestigious bounties. So I want to finish that up. All right, let's see. We're down here at Ringneck Creek. So he's, we're going to have to track him down, I feel like. He's tainting some hides or something down here. Mm-hmm. Mean old Jebediah. So why why is he fled into the woods, I wonder? I thought the law was after him or something.
feel like he's going to be... I don't know where uh, all Eugene would be, you know? If I was all Eugene, I don't know where I'd be at. I know he's up to no good, though, with a name like Eugene. You know? Got some party liquor bottles and, like, can of something down here. I'm gonna pick these mushrooms while we're at it. It won't let me pick. Stop tracking. Yeah, let me pick these chanterelles. Some humming or some little sage. We're gonna use that to cook up some meat here in a minute, probably. Dang, this fella's leaving clues all over the place. Oh, hello. There we go. What he done? Skinned him a little rabbit right there. I lose the trail okay up here keep charging me for my camp upkeep and I ain't never at camp <laughs> I should just disband camp huh pack it up we'll go see Crips eventually though Oh, it's giving me two options. All right, come on. We're getting on jib. The uh, eagle eye wall, or dead eye wall on the horse is so awesome. Well, he did not even see me coming. That's why they call me the master of stealth. I don't know seen me play Assassin's Creed but you know always gotta check their pockets you know can't have that uh at nine cents <laughs> go to waste and he had a collectible in his pocket I'm thinking Something weird has happened with my collectibles. Unless they're like in a hidden invisible inventory. Because I know I picked up like a couple tarot cards. Uh, like I just picked up that ring thing. Probably picked up more collectibles along the way. And uh, I can't for the life of me find them in my inventory. Ain't in no real hurry to get back there. Let's see if we can find an animal or something on the way. I hear a pig. That ain't worth it. You star deer. Oh. That ain't gonna. What I say? I did not mean to do that. I meant to skin it. Oh, come on. Boy, boy, I'm fat fingering the controls all over the place right now. 
I'm just trying to skin this thing. Okay, uh, yeah, there we go. Just tuck that under Eugene. We got us some venison. We're gonna be eating good night, tell ya. Maybe we can get another critter on the way back here. Maybe not. Ooh. Eugene, you, you rascal. Trying to escape. I need to invest in that uh, reinforced lasso, but that's a lot of money. That's like 350. I mean, I know in the long run it's gonna be worth it, but right now it's like, mm. Alright, let's get up in there. And drop this thing off. I was just this second gonna head out there and bring that one in myself. Put him in the sale. He wasn't gonna go do that. Point two four, twenty four dollars. All right, we'll take it. Uh, we need to go to the fence, sell some stuff. Guess that's that. There's something else I was gonna. Oh yeah, need to check see what these dailies were. New Hanover, okay. Uh, General American Badgers, Muskrats, Old to Gus. Who's Gus? Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer's way out of the way, I think. We'll jump from one horse to another horse. We can do that. We need new Hanover bounties. We can go do those. Oh. Where, where exactly is it? For me. Well, look at the map, right, man. man. Better be good. Okay, so that was all I had to sell to him. That's kind of lame. I want uh the gunslinger pistol scan for the Schofield revolvers. But that thing's 600 bucks. And then, so that means I gotta go 600 times two. Cause that's how math works and how many guns I carry. Uh, so I don't know if we're gonna do that. But I want it. Seen a lot of that lately, but they always move. Oh, I can sell them wolf hearts, I reckon. Let's do it. Can I jump from one horse to another horse while just sitting still?
Uh, New Hanover, that's where we need to go. Up uh, there, Valentine, Emerald Ranch. We can go up there to Emerald Ranch. Okay. Onward. We've done pretty pretty okay. I know last night we were down like we didn't have any gold after we bought the prestigious thing, and we're already back to two eighty six. So I mean, it ain't it ain't great, but it ain't it ain't nothing. Oh shoot! I should have uh oh, get get off, Jeb. All right, I should have uh, looked and seen. Yeah, we can do a legendary. So this one's on five star. So it, it, I mean, it's the one we gotta do. Gotta do it. That's my only one on five star right now. So I'll remember to start my timer this time too. Watch, watch me. <laughs> it's just too. Uh, I hate, I hate that I, I wait 12 minutes whenever I do this bounty, but it's just, it's worth it. All right. Etta Doyle used to be known as Madame La Pearl. She runs a gang of other fallen women, sticking up trains and coaches mostly, but seems to have a particular... Wish we could skip it. Wish we could skip the cutscene. So Every single time. <laughs> at Cornwall's freight yard in San Denis. Asked if I can send some good bounty hunters their way. Just be careful. They play smart. Uh, looks like she only sent one. Okay, we gotta move fast here. Come on. Now the bait's already been sent. He says, absconce yourself up in there. In scones? That sounds like a uh, like a breakfast pastry or something, you know. Look at old Charles. We get rid of her, everyone's happy. Now don't worry about her cronies. She's the one with the price on her head. They're notorious for dressing alike. So you bide your time. You figure out which one's doing. You'll know for sure when you see her face. Got a big old scar down her right cheek. And we're just gonna hang around and stand guard. Create some semblance of security. And just pray the crazy bitch don't bust in and shoot us straight in the face. All right, now it's time. Find a place to hide, and we'll wait for the guest of honor. They do a fine job standing guard, I do say. pretty good there Seeing if there's any of these I got. Oh, I can reset this one.
What town have I not visited yet? Strawberry? Probably Strawberry. That was like a point eight gold. Look at me go. Ain't bad. You should be about ready. Uh, around about the four minute mark, she says the key words that we need to hear, and then we go hog tire, and then everyone runs away. So we're gonna try and do this, you know, without a hitch here. They talking about how they get set up. He uses some colorful language and then we run in there and rope her up. I uh I don't even feel bad about doing this cuz it's been years and they could have patched it, you know. But they gave up on the game. I hope they bring it back to life. I really do. Oh, it's taller hat. Come on, Jeb. And then Jeb dies quick like the wind, so they don't ever catch up with us when we just do this number. And we'll be chilling at the sheriff's office for seven minutes or something. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, he's so worth it. Like it's so like this is so it's it's, it's worth it. It's worth it. It sucks though at the same time, but it is worth it. I just about turned it in on accident. If you do like this, she can't run away if you got her. She can't untie herself, so here we are. For five, six, six minutes, 30 seconds. Because we started stopwatch. <laughs> Pretty wild, man. I was reading, I was reading all about, uh, Whenever I get invested in a game, then I do a whole bunch of, you know, I just do researching and Googling and all that. And I remember about these missions where you sit here and you wait, right? Uh, and I was like, man, why is that? And one of the threads I ran across probably on Reddit or something was like, you know, if they want to talk about keeping people playing their game and the amount of time you have to invest to like progress in the game and keep people playing it then this is kind of a strategy where it's like you make more money for taking longer on the mission. So it encourages people to take longer on the missions. But at the same time, it's like kind of such a boring way to approach it. Because most people end up doing this and we stand here for five minutes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's like, kind of, it's kind of a weird thing. It's kind of a weird thing.
but it is what it is. Still enjoy the game. Still having fun. Where did we say we were going? We're going to go Emerald Station after this. Got three bucks in gold. Collectible ring. Yeah, where did my tarot cards go? Like, my tarot cards straight up disappeared. That's trash, bro. I don't understand that. Unless there's somewhere else that I am completely missing. I thought there was a, a different section for like the collectibles in the bag. I'm gonna Google that while we sit here. So, way to check tarot cards in your progression menu. No more cards here. You can also get to them in the satchel menu. Parker's menu. So maybe there's a different way to look at it, a different menu maybe? I don't know, we'll look. You got like a minute. 30 progress. That does me no good.
So yeah, I found 10 collectibles and I know I haven't been able to sell any of them. That's wild. I don't understand that. Maybe they're somewhere. Maybe they're in my inventory. But, uh, I can't see them because... Yeah, maybe. All right, let's go turn this in. I'm glad you got him alive. Retribution shall be visited. We pay on receipt of goods, so there you go. I gotta go do two bounties in New Hanover for my daily. Getting through these, uh, we're getting through these ranks fairly quickly, uh, which is good. It's a good thing. Because we want the treasure maps every time we level up. See, now there's a freaking tarot card in there. There's two tarot cards. In what in the world, dude? Something weird's going on, dude. Something janky's going on with this stuff. They gotta be in my inventory. They just don't show up anywhere or something. Because I know I picked up... We picked up like 10 collectibles. So I don't know where exactly they are. Or if there's a way for me to go look at them, period. Maybe back at camp or something? I don't know, dude. Oh. Emerald Station. We got seven hundred. We're doing pretty good on that front. Uh, we need the bounty hunter wagon. That's something we're looking at getting. Um, we need bolas. I gotta figure out. I think I gotta be rank ten to get the bolas though. Ouch. So really, we're just going after three widows. I don't know if that's going to have me go after all three at once. You know what I'm saying? Better Live, Cooper Brothers. The Lads. Let's try one of these. Let's see. Capture Widow. Cassie Brady. Okay. So just one of them. Uh, we need to... Whatever. We can uh, worry about what level I get Bola's at later. Pick right here. What we got? Some carrots. And I think with the the mission timer, what I've read is that it'll start. Uh, it starts like before. Uh, the timer timer starts. So like right now, the mission timer where I'm like earning more money is already going. Come on, Jeb. Oh. 
wonder where the hideout is. Is it going to be that little fort? When they're stealth. Can't nobody see me. This plan may go real sideways. All right, I'm gonna cut you free, don't worry. I just gotta see about doing all my looting. What you got in this lockbox? I think at one point there were lockboxes like around the world that had just money in them. Got me some crackers. What's up? What are you doing? Head back that way. You'll see him. No, please, no. Okay, she's been attacking some travelers near the Pleasant Settlement. That don't sound too pleasant of her. Let's mosey on over there and let's see what we can see what we can see. See what we can't come about, you know? Where's she at? She got homies or just her? Oh, she running already. Why she ain't have a gun? Ouch. Oh. Is she... She's still alive, right? I hope. I think we just knocked her out. I hope, I hope we just knocked her out. Who is shooting? Oh, 
I don't know who was shooting at me. I didn't even see them. They're way away. So Rhodes is not too, too far. I don't think I killed her. I kicked her twice, though, while I had my lasso out. So hopefully we're all right there. You know what I'm saying? We're looking for something to get like a little skin, a little meat, something else. There's a little supplement while we uh, sort of mosey on back there real slow like. Because, you know, we get paid more for taking our time. We get paid by the hour, not by the job, you know? <laughs> who, who else out there is an hourly worker? You make a 30-minute job, take half a day, we get paid by the hour, you know? Oh, my goodness. Take all the breaks you can when you're getting paid by the hour. I need to uh, get me some of this rum, I reckon. A little bit of that in my system. Get my dead eye back up. You think that rum would do the opposite? Make your dead eye go down, you know? But I guess you gotta, you know, in them cowboy days, you steady your nerves, you know? Everyone was probably drinking a whole lot back then. Heck, the, uh, them party liquors was, uh, was more sanitary to drink than the water half the time back then. You know, catch you some sort of parasite from drinking, uh, drinking water. And hey, this fella might be up to no good. I'm gonna cut off the road, see if he follows. Uh huh. You just keep on going. Yo, what's up, dude? Chilling, chilling. Just enjoying the, the Wild West out here. I knew what you done meant. I'm gonna be upset if I uh, messed up and accidentally unalive this lady. And then waste my time running around, wasting time, you know? Hey, what's this? That's like a cow skeleton or something? That wandered away from the pasture. Oh, maybe that's a horse. What you think? That's got to be a horse. Tiny horse, though. Arguments. Who? Who's arguing? You arguing with somebody? American food doesn't taste good? What are they classifying as American food? Fried chicken? Hamburgers? They crazy, dude. Hamburgers are goaded. I don't care who you are. I love me a hamburger. Ooh, let me do this. Let me do this real quick. I bet I can do this. Sorry. <laughs> Dude, I mean, like, what, though? Like... We eat food from all over the place because America's a big old melting pot. Some people don't be using seasoning. I know that's like a, a stereotype with white people. They don't be using seasoning and think pepper spicy. You know what I'm saying? But like some of us know how to cook, dog. Your boy be eating good. It's a complicated argument. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. People be wilding out on the internet. 
I will say, like, some of the stuff that, uh, that my mom used to make growing up was not that great. Lots of cream of mushroom soup and stuff. Not to say that I, I will always love my mama's cooking, but, uh, you know, looking back, it was like, hmm. I don't follow any sports, dog. Uh, I know. I know. I just, I can't do it. I think, I think it's because, like, the games are long, and my attention span is, you know, you see me play video games, I'm all over the place. Uh, unless I get, like, super hyper-focused, but I can't make myself enjoy a sport like that. I just, I don't know. I don't know. Doesn't resonate with me. Nope. Not a sports guy. Not at all. I uh, used to watch uh, fighting. Some fighting. Some MMA stuff. But I never really like got deep in it. Following like what this fighter is going to be fighting this fighter this week. And have you seen the card coming up? And like never, never got into it. Everyone loves football around here though. And I'm like a heathen when they ask what team I go for. And I'm like, ah, uh, you know, <laughs> eh, eh, you know. I like when the Olympics come on, you know what I'm saying? I'll watch that. I'll watch, uh, sometimes I'll watch that uh, Red Bull skateboarding. Like, that's pretty cool. That's a sport. Seems someone's time is all but spent. Sales open. Spend it in town. There's one out of two. Delivered alive. 517.32. dollars Let's go, dude. That ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. Now we gotta get back over there and do another one. Jackie Chan guy. Jackie Chan's dope. I like Jackie Chan. Uh martial artist. I like uh Tony Tony Ja. Tony Ya was in that his name. Uh, God, what's that movie called? The Protector? And they made a Protector 2, but the Protector 1 was the, the real one you gotta watch. Uh, and then Donnie Yen. Donnie Yen's fire, too. Uh, Jet Li. Jet Li's okay, but I was never, like, a huge Jet Li guy. But Donnie Yen, uh, has done some pretty cool stuff, too. It Man, I think was the name of the movie you need to watch with Donnie Yen. I love me some good kung fu movies, but uh, I just haven't watched any in a while. Yeah, Jackie Chan was fire, especially back in the day. And he's like, for his age, he's still like, that's wild, dude. And he can still do some of the stuff he'd be doing. Okay, so I can't, there's currently no leads for this bounty check back later. Okay, so there's cooldowns on that. Okay, Cooper Brothers uh we'll do we'll do one of these violent murder okay stabbings and two horse thefts i kind of want to try one of these with the double ups but i know that's going to be hard for me because i got to steal a horse and then uh call my horse kind of thing it should be twice the money though right we're gonna try it We might have to unalive one and bring one in alive, you know? How far away these fellas is? Way up there. They're heading south, though. So I'm gonna, if I see a horse along the way, I'm gonna try and steal it, 
That way I can have that horse and Jebediah. Oop. Sorry, sir. This is nothing. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, that's nothing personal. Here, we're going to do this better. I can't jump to the horse. Oh my. Okay. Well, I just screwed that up. I don't know if that messes up my bounty or not. Uh, we're just going to go do it now. I was trying to be all sneaky. And that dude got upset that I was messing with him, apparently. And then I fat fingered the aim button. I bet they're on horses. I bet they are. Gotta be. They're on a road. Boy, they way out here, huh? They're going to be surrounded by dudes, maybe. Oh, they're in a cave for sure, then. That's not one of them. That's one of them. supposed to get them out of here once you get them
I gotta find a horse or something. This guy's gonna try and run away. I mean, if they get untied, they're definitely gonna run away. Another horse. A prison wagon. I wonder if I can come back and get it. Get the other guy. Like a sheer cliff over there. There ain't no way he's still gonna be knocked out when I get back over there. We'll see. This wagon's got to be pretty close over here, then. I'll sprint real fast to it. Maybe not. Maybe it's not real close. Ooh. Oh, boy. Gravity done got me there, huh? Jib, are you okay? He's worst cowboy ever. I'm the greatest bounty hunter in the West, I tell you, old Charles. Is this dude on alive now or is he still okay? He's probably, he's probably dead. I can still go get him. I can still go get him. Nice. So that was uh, my second one brought in from New Hanover there. I'm probably... Probably got, you know, time. Oh, no. Don't, don't do that. Yeah, we got to go down here, bud. There's a fellow on a horse when I needed him. Jeb's like part mountain goat, I think. Look at him go. I find the entrance to this cave again. here maybe <sighs> I think that other fella was thoroughly unalived by the time we got back there now we're gonna be 
We're gonna be pushing it and getting out of here. I should have dismissed Jeb. Or put a waypoint. That would have been smart too. Ain't nobody said I was the smartest now. Ain't the sharpest crown in the knife drawer, is that, uh, that how that goes? Ain't the, the brightest uh, light bulb in the crayon box, you know? Ain't no rocket surgeon, that's for sure. Alright, let's go, dude. Let me follow the road. I think, I think we should have four minutes to get there. So do them guys each count as like their own, uh, like their own payout, I guess? So it'd be like, if one was $20, both of them would be, you know, 40 something together. job Jeb Jeb you're actually you know the best of boys I swear my horse stays better fed than I do complaining no more there you go good luck out there so was a payout there two alive zero dead nice 136 50 dollars nice that ain't bad that ain't bad we knocked one out we just left him there uh knocking him out's the way to go then you just hold the lasso and then kick him. Let's go back to Emerald Station. What is this? Become a collector. Oh, she moves. Madame Nazar moves around then, huh? We could go talk to her. I don't think we can use anything. Let's go, just for curiosity's sake, let's go, uh... Let's go talk to her. I don't think we can do anything though. I don't think we can interact with her on any other level other than just be like, hey, what's up? How you doing? Uh, my name is old Charles. Nice to meet you, Madame Nazar. Um, that sort of thing, you know?
We need to work on getting Jeb a better saddle. We need that Nacogdoches. What's up, Madam Nazar? What a pure and gentle spirit. Hey, you doing? What's she doing? Some yoga or something? Hello, stranger. You don't got the eye. Just an eye for a deal. I told you, go away, old man. Nothing but false prophecies and fake jewelry. Go away, for I see much pain and suffering in your future. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> a crook and a charlatan. Make sure you know what you're getting into with this one. Hey, please, don't listen to him. I am Madame Nassar, channeler of spirits, finder of lost things, and, since everyone seems to be a fortune teller now, seller of the strange and exotic. Which one of these can I help you with today? Wait, don't speak. Let me see. Yes, yes, you're searching for something. What though? A dead lover whose spirit you wish to contact on the other side? No, no, it, it's not that. It's not She that seems like a sweet lady. Something you're missing. Yes, purpose. Some meaning in the cave. This lie. Well, Charles, like, what you see in there, lady? I don't see nothing. I see a good looking man looking back at me. But I think that's just me. I tell them what I'm looking for, and they collect it for me from far and wide. Sometimes with ease, and sometimes through great hardship. You got some pet birds up there? They look nice. Honest as you want it to be. Hmm. How about it? Do you want to be one of my collectors? One of your I'm collectors? Sure they are rewarded quite handsomely. A small fee is really the least I should ask for giving you what you're looking for. Uh -huh. you up with everything you need to get started. She's running kind of a Ponzi scheme, I think. Of course, but first, you will need to prove yourself. If you don't want to start now, you can find me again and. The offer will still be there. Oh, if money is the problem, then that is the first thing you should go looking for. When you found some, return to me, and I will set you uh -huh. your way. All right, Madam Nazar. We'll catch you around, I reckon. You'll find Madam Nazar again. Person clicks back. Can I sell you things? I hear tell of your good deeds, but you do not. I can buy things. Uh, 15. Oh, that's all I can buy. Aguila Machete. Okay. Alright, well. I'll catch you around then, I reckon. Jebediah, where'd you go, bud? You could not bear to part with that. Hmm. Well, I can wait. We did pretty good. We made some money. We made some decent money today. Uh, yeah. We need to check our uh, rank. Our rank for our bounty hunter. See where we're at there. I know we got to be getting close to at least being able to get the bolas. And I think the saddle we want is level 20. So we've got a ways to go before we get our bounty hunter saddle. Um, I don't know if we should get the wagon right this second or what's going on over here? Something red over there. Get the. Do some shooting, maybe? A player? A 
Okay. Uh, oh, well, this doesn't look welcoming. Um, let's let's make ourselves scarce here. Uh, yeah. I need the bolas. We need the bolas for sure, for sure. That's gonna be a big plus when we get that. Um, so let's go. We'll look, and then I'll probably uh, end the stream right around here. Cause I feel like uh, getting kind of late for me. So if we look in our catalog, uh, we should be able to go to workwear and trades, bounty hunter. We don't really super want any of this. Britain. Uh, rank 10. Yeah. We could get the Delgado saddle right now if we wanted to. That gun belt's cool. We want that. We do want that. Uh, we could get that gun belt and the offhand, I think. Can't get the offhand just yet. 10. Where are we at on this? So let's check our progress here. Got to be getting close. Eight. So we're almost there. Yeah, so I think that's going to do it. Uh, still having fun, man. Not getting bored yet. Um, me and old Charles, you know, old Charles and uh, Jebediah out here doing, doing all these Wild West things. Uh, ready to get back on with Toast Pop whenever he's ready. So that'll be fun to be reunited with Cletus whenever that happens. Uh, maybe this weekend. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I'll catch you guys later. You know where to find me. We'll probably be doing this or maybe some Assassin's Creed uh, tomorrow. So I'll see you then, maybe. Peace.